To be a member of the cabinet. Well, hey, favorite. Favorite. Homecoming in front page. The film looks saturated. Have you thought about doing an internship? <laughs> Ultimately, we'll all learn from your studies. About USC really embraces the whole academic experience, and the professors here are wonderful. Out of the house. Students come first, and that's reflected in the academics. The liberal arts education is critical at USD, regardless of what your major is. I am currently majoring in behavior neuroscience as well as theater. We want our students to think on their feet, to think about what it is to be human. I would really like to combine both the behavior and neuroscience as well as theater. I think through theater you can analyze a lot of the human condition that you wouldn't be able to otherwise. Okay. I would not be thy executioner. I fly thee for I would not injure thee. Now I do frown upon thee for... I don't remember. I'm horrible at these monologues. Let's go back to the 19... I'm one of those students who really likes to be engaged in my classes, and the honors program is a really great environment to have that deeper engagement, especially between the professor and the students. One of our biggest strengths is the small class sizes here at USD. The students get so much high touch and support from the faculty. And another great thing about the honors program is that they have team talk courses. They have two professors who teach the same class, but the professors can be from two totally different academic departments. You get two different perspectives of that one subject. It's a more enriched experience with your professors. We get to know the students on a more personal basis and work with them one-on-one. -on -one. We train our students with an open and broad education that allows them to work closely with faculty. The hallmark of our department is that intimate connection between research and learning. In the Department of Chemistry and Biochemistry, we require about 100 hours of research for each student. The academics at USD are definitely rigorous. You really do have to put a lot of work into the classes. You get a different vibe and a different college experience when you walk outside and you don't have to put on a jacket and people are sitting out on the grass just hanging out. Or you can eat dinner outside the entire school year. You may walk across campus and be struck by the beauty. The beauty of the campus is definitely one of the reasons I chose USD. I think some of the sunsets here are just absolutely so gorgeous, so unbelievable. I live on Mission Beach, which is a huge USD community. I love to go bodyboarding early in the morning. There's so much to do here at University of San Diego. There's so many ways to get involved. The University of San Diego has over 200 clubs and organizations. Oh. So many different events here. Multicultural, academic, social, athletic, it's great. You can join as many clubs as you want. I am involved in mariachi ensemble. Outdoor Adventures is a club we have here on campus. We run all types of trips into these outdoor environments. I belong to People of the Islands Club. We teach Hula and we're very open to anybody learning. The USC is so accepting of different cultures. We are looking for the whole holistic student. I'm a member of SOAR, and SOAR stands for Student Outreach and Recruitment, and we are working to increase diversity on the USD campus. I belong to Beta Theta Pi fraternity, and it's what the thing I look most forward to every single week. Being a Beta means not only looking out for yourself, it means looking out for the benefits of others as well, and it's all about doing the right thing when no one's looking. What are your initial reactions to these videos? I'm in BSU, which is the Black Student Union. It's really great to have that community. Homecoming weekend is absolutely amazing. It's one of my favorite weeks here on campus. 
I do a lot of the photography work and design and editing for the Vista newspaper, a student-run publication. If we don't have a club that you want, then you can start your own. And it really has just blossomed into something that's wonderful for everyone. I live on campus in what's called San Buenaventura. We each have our own room, and we also do have the shared living area, including a kitchen. So I challenge myself to make my own food. I'm just mac and cheese. Really? That's always great. A lot of mishaps, a lot of burned food. <laughs> resident assistant in Founders Hall and Freshman Hall. As a freshman, you live in a living learning community. The first year students will have a class that they choose to be their preceptorial class. And then what happens? Each freshman is able to choose one of nine games that they can participate in. The people who are in that course with you are also living in the same dorm as you. And our overarching concept is that And that professor is your advisor until you declare a major. The faculty mentor, the preceptor, focuses on advising, so we'll oftentimes help students figure out classes, um, discern their, their goals for the future, and also they have a peer mentor called a preceptorial assistant. A preceptorial assistant is a current upperclassman student, typically a sophomore, junior, or senior, and they are an academic advisor to first-year students. Identify two to three preceptees you were able to connect with. We do get frequently refreshed with training, and this training is ongoing throughout that whole entire year. I'm in the sustainability living learning community because issues of sustainability I'm really passionate about. We received an award recently as one of the top most sustainable universities nationwide. Sustainability means having a clean environment, doing the right things for the university, and doing the right things for the planet. We really see sustainability in our efforts to have locally sourced foods, to have healthy options. Garden Club, the Green Farming Collective, was started this semester. They put on a farmer's market where they had all sustainable foods, a no-waste program that really informed the student body about how to make our campus a more sustainable place. We grow a lot of things that we use in the Missions Cafe. We don't have any plastic at the cafe. We have corn cups and corn utensils that are all biodegradable. This is the purified water. We recycle blood, newspapers, and food, but yet we don't recycle water. We are trying to make San Diego sustainable in terms of our water conditions. I want to make sure my students really think about how they can make a difference. So that's more of an historiography kind of question. We have developed a liberal arts education that not only trains students to be academically strong, but it animates them to make a difference in the world. More and more students are choosing USD because they want to be a part of social change. The Changemaker mission of the university is really promoting compassionate service, ethical conduct, and engaged citizenship. Whether you're a student or faculty, you're here because you're passionate about change making. We were designated in Ashoka Changemaker campus and students are aware of this and they know that they can be the change in whatever area they choose to go into. Our students leave this campus knowing how they're going to have an impact in the world. Our mission is to get students to apply what they're learning in the classroom outside of the classroom. So we give them a lot of opportunities for engaged experiences. We have internships, we have study abroad. We have an online job board, Torero Link, with over a thousand live jobs and internship opportunities. I did an internship with the Scripps Institution of Oceanography around the subject of the leopard sharks that come around La Jolla. It was a really great experience to be able to know how to work around marine life and getting to learn a lot more about leopard shark as a species as well. I'm an intern at the County of San Diego in the Department of Housing and Community Development. I have real responsibilities working in the Density Bonus Program, a program started in the 80s with 13 housing developments that offer housing to low-income families. Study abroad is a unique opportunity to allow students to test their boundaries, to challenge their viewpoint and their perspective. In fall of my junior year, I traveled around 16 different countries over the course of four months while traveling kind of like on a cruise ship and studying there. I went to Kenya and Tanzania and it was a wildlife management program. It was one of the greatest experiences I've ever had. USD's been just absolutely incredible.
You get all these lifetime experiences that you're not going to have anywhere else. I love the food at USD. I love how friendly everybody is. I love the professors. I love the beach. The small class sizes. I love athletics. Intramurals. Women's soccer team. I love this unbelievable campus. Founders Chapel. The palm trees. I love the clubs. City of Rock. I love the weather. The sunshine. I love the community. It's my home away from home. Absolutely love it, and I wouldn't trade my experience for the world.